Hello, 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 hello. Your best to join her here. Your best to join her here. Welcome. Listen, if you haven't already, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. How is this always been? It's going to be spread across the YouTube verse and the interweb. This is the place and the space where luxury meets authenticity. Listen, if you have not been following along, you need to go ahead. Hop over to my channel when you're done with this video and check out all that has been happening. We are in Monte Carlo. Listen to me. Celebrating our honeymoon slash anniversary. And I am just here to say I am truly enjoying it. Okay, so today is the day we have the unboxing for Lord Piana. Yes, it's a big bag. This year, let me tell you, I meant business. I ended up going to Laura Piana after I left Hermes. And let me tell you, I was so, so stressed out by the time I got to Laura Piana that when I walked into the door and the sales associates started to speak to me, I just was everywhere. Hubs was like, calm down you know, relax, try to breathe because I just was, I was, I, yeah, I was feeling some kind of way. I was feeling some kind of way when I left Hermes. So when we got to Laura Piana, I was just so excited. But at the same time, I didn't know what to expect because I did not get the items that I wanted really from Hermes. So I was like, okay, maybe that's just how it's gonna be across the board. I'm gonna do a quick plug because we also did pop over to Celine and they did not have the item I was looking for there either. I will insert a picture so that you can see the sweater. It is the cutest sweater that I wanted from Celine. They did not have it available. The purse, those person told me that it was actually from an older season, but it's on the website, so I'm kind of confused. But instead, what I did was I went ahead and ordered it on a website. I mean, it was right there. She tried to give me some that were comparable, meaning they had stripes, but they were black and like off-white tones as far as the stripes. And I want navy or marine and white. You know, I know that for some it may not matter, but for me, that's that's just what I was looking for. So I went ahead, we, we sat in the store, Hubs and I, and just placed the order while we were there. They didn't even offer to order it for me. I just hopped onto my phone and did it. When I got to Laura Piana, I was over it. I was just over all of it. Just scattered and stressed. And the salesperson was so lovely. She was so, so, so sweet so very kind that was fabulous now you know in one of my past unboxings i had a mini laura piana unboxing already and in that unboxing i had got the collared sweater and the dress and let me tell you when i went to the outlets in petty by disney and found laura piana i was so excited because i was able to kind of get a feel for what the designer and the brand was about and equality and so on and so forth before investing any money. And when we got to Monte Carlo, I already knew that there was a Laura Piana to hear. And I also had some items that I put on my wish list that I would I had decided that if I could not pick them up here, I would pick them up definitely in Paris. I just was not really hopeful. <laughs> I was not hopeful at all. I was like, okay, this it, it just may not happen at all. And Okay, so we go into the store because I'm babbling. You know, you know, you know, I like talking to you. You know, I like talking to you. So I'm going to stop babbling and rambling on and get to what I need to say. The essay was very sweet. She was very welcoming, very accommodating. I actually just showed her the items that I was looking for because I already had them pulled up online. And she was immediately on it. She was like, okay, yes. We have this item, I'm going to call for it now so it's brought in. We just got our resort line in today. You will not find this anywhere else. It is only going to be at this location. It was so wonderful. All the pieces that I was wanting, I just told her and she was able to call whoever she was calling and they brought the items to us and I tried them on. I tried on so many things. Let me tell you, 
I was so proud of myself because <laughs> typically I am not that person. But because she was putting in such a effort, I was like, okay, I'm willing to be open and try. And she, she asked me the things I like, but at the same time, she also made a lot of suggestions based on my body type and so on and so forth. So I was very appreciative of that. So let's go ahead and get into this unboxing. And let me also add, after that, honey, listen, Hubs was like, well, maybe I'll get some pieces next time. Like he did get something this time. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I love it. I love my husband. But he said futuristically, as far as clothing, he is also interested in trying out the ready to wear, which I think is going to look fabulous on him. That is why I like Hermes, you know, because the pieces I gravitate towards are classic staples that are going to last. And I don't feel one designer solely is a carrier of that. I think there are so many other designers out there and some of them may not even be high end that you can find these classic staples and it'll be fine. It's just that for me, I, when I saw these pieces at Laura Piana, I was like, I knew this is where I was gonna go. And I told you in the video, when I did the unboxing from the outlet of Laura Piana, I told you, I said, I'm going to get this item. And I did. So let's get into this unboxing, shall we? And let me tell you, they even, we, we made the purchases, we checked out, and they had the items delivered to the hotel. So we did not have to tote any bags around while we were taking in and appreciating Monte Carlo. So that right there was everything to me. I'm gonna start with this piece because this is the piece that I told you that I wanted so, so badly. And I was looking for, I said it so many times in the last video, I think I edited it out a couple of times. I said it so much. But this is the piece I have been looking for. Yes, oh my goodness. There you have it. This black, sorry, I know it's a black turtleneck. You're probably like, wait, you did all that for this. Yes, it is a black turtleneck. I always bring a black turtleneck. I've told you this story, but I'm gonna tell you again. I always bring a black turtleneck with me when I come to France. And every time I bring my black turtleneck, I fall in love with it. And so I decided I'm going to leave the one that I brought with me, which is the Saint Laurent um, cashmere turtleneck, and it's in black. I'm going to leave that here this time, and I was going to just get a new one to take back, and this is the designer I decided to go with, which is Laura Piana, because when I saw it on the website, I knew this would be the closest to what I was looking for and to replicate what I already have. So here is a close up of that, and it is cashmere. Just beautiful, beautiful. It is thin enough, so it's not heavy, it's very light but not so light that it will not keep you warm. I will add this size, so I will try these on, so don't worry about that, I will try them on. This is a size 42, and what I did while I was there was I asked the essay what she thought. Of course, I always asked Hubs, but I also asked her what she thought as far as the sizing, and she was like, yes, you want it to be, a nice fitting, also not too tight, but you do not want to have too much material in the shoulders and in the sides. So I went with the 42. What I forgot when I went to Laura Piana at the outlet is Italian brands tend to run much smaller than even the French brands in my experience. So I knew before going to go bigger and then work backwards. So I knew 42 would work because the sweater that I got from the outlet, the Laura Piana outlet, was a 42 and the way it fit, it was perfect. So I got this piece and I am so just loving it.
Then I got another one in a white ivory tone. And I will show you as to why I picked this up in a second. So this is a second turtleneck that I ended up picking up as well. And it's just as beautiful. And it's a beautiful, beautiful white. There was another one that was more of a tan. I was close to getting it at first because when I said I wanted a white, she brought that one out. And the more I thought about it, the more I was like, okay, no, that's more closer to a tannish tone than an ivory white. So I'm happy that I had her bring this one out just to check because as soon as I saw it, I was like, yes, this, this is the one. So I got two turtlenecks. And of course, <laughs> I have picked up another one of the sweaters, like the one I picked up at the outlet, but this one just came out. So it's new in the collection is newer. Yes, and it's an, a nice ivory tone. Listen, you'll see in a minute. You'll see, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put this aside and let me make sure I tell you the size. Okay, so this is a medium. Because it's a medium, it will probably, there's a very good chance that it too will be either, a, no, it will be a 42, but this is a medium so that you know. Then, <laughs> this, this is fabulous. This, this one is fabulous. I think I'm gonna, I may have a little difficulty showing you this piece, but listen, I had to unpack this because I think I'm wearing this one tonight. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. It is a jumper. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. No words. There are no, listen to me. I have no words to describe how fabulous this jumper is. When I tried it on, like when I saw it, I knew, but when I tried it, tried it on, when I tried it on, I knew this was going to be a forever piece in my wardrobe. And let me tell you, one of the other cell associates brought a belt out and put it around my waist when I tried this on. And I just was like, no, no, you'll see. I'm gonna try this on for you. And as you can hear, I'm very excited about this piece. I'm gonna give you a close up. Just look at that. Look at that material. It is so beautiful. So you can see through it so so beautiful it's just one of those pieces that is made for brunch you know monte carlo right like it's just a very very beautiful piece Let's move on. This is Hubs. I have been telling Hubs about Laura Piana's, the shoes that everyone talks about. He ended up getting, I'm gonna, you know what? Let me do this one first and then I can explain it. He ended up getting a pair, but I'm gonna do these first because this is what happened. I tried these on. And as soon as I tried these on, I told Hubs, you have to get a pair of these too. And here you go. These loafers. Now do you see why the turtleneck, 
the jumper. <laughs> the polo sweater it just made so much sense when i tried them on i had my my cream slacks on and they worked effortlessly with these shoes these shoes are so comfortable if i could get these in this leather in black and so on and so forth i would they did not have them in black they had them in a suede in different colors but i did not want to go the suede route I just stuck with these for now. Because I got those, I told Hubs, I kept talking about them. Hubs decided that he would try them as well. So he did. And this is what Hubs ended up getting. And his is in the suede. Look how wonderful those are. And it's the dotted bottoms. These shoes, these shoes by far are the most comfortable shoes I've ever tried. I cannot make this up. I walked around the store with these on for so long and it felt like I was walking on clouds and I did not even need to put an insert in. Now, let me say, I always share this when I share an unboxing when it comes to shoes. I wear a seven and a half traditionally but since i started purchasing designer shoes i have started to purchase a 38 so an eight i go up a half a size just for comfort and i tried these on in the 37 and a half or seven and a half they were comfortable but i felt more confident by just going up that extra half size because if i'm walking a prolonged period of time i want to make sure that it's comfortable also if i want to put a thin you know nylon or a sock on i can do that as well if i so choose so yes these are the shoes i ended up with they are fabulous fabulous very very comfortable i will be wearing these i will be wearing these probably tonight that i think is all the only thing left is this gift from our essay here it is and these are italian cookies I have not tried them as yet. She said that they are fabulous. I am going to try them and I will let you know. But she gave these to us as a thank you. She was amazing. She was amazing, hands down. I mean, everyone within Lorpiana at the Monte Carlo Boutique was spectacular. If you find yourself in the space and you want to just go and browse, I highly recommend you pop into Laura Piani here. It was just such a fabulous experience. Whenever we come back, I will definitely be popping in there. That's how much of an impression they left on me. So that is all I have for you today. And I really do thank you for joining me. And I appreciate you taking the time out to, you know, share this moment with me. Thank you for joining me. Until next time.